Hey guys, Les here, aka Gorth Ballion, and welcome to my abode. And actually, this is a new place that my wife and I just recently purchased. Um, I'm excited to say we're gonna be first time landlords. And actually, we're also renovating this place because it was in much need of renovating. The carpet was ugly and old, etc. And uh, so we're replacing the whole floor, the whole upstairs, and I'll give you a little peek tour. You can see here we actually added the subfloor, ripped off the carpet because this was, uh, it's too much light there. It was actually a mix of carpet and floor, kind of see there. And so we ripped off the carpet, we put in this, uh, the, we put in this, uh, we raised this portion here, um, put some plywood down, and we're gonna just uh, do vinyl plaking um, throughout uh, the whole bottom floor and then carpet upstairs. Uh, so lots to do here and we're also, uh, uh, the place that we're currently in, we're also doing some renovations there because the walls are scratched up from having kids, etc, etc. So we're absolutely swamped. So if anybody was wondering, hey, where's Gordon Bellion? Why isn't he filming as much? It's because, hey, you know, we're getting stuff done here. We're getting some business done. So um, that's, uh, that's the situation. Now, I never actually imagined myself. And let's take a sneak peek upstairs. You can see we already ripped off all the carpet there. Um, I never imagined myself as a landlord. Uh, I kind of wanted, because I have friends that, that uh, have some rental properties. and But I was like, you know what? I really want to focus on business. But... <laughs> you know, just for fun, we're looking at houses. It's fun with the kids to they romp around all those show homes and stuff like that and all the open houses. And then we're like, okay, well, let's just get pre-approved and see what we can afford. And wow, you know, we can actually afford more than we thought. Uh, <laughs> so uh, one thing led to another and now we have another property, which is awesome. And we're gonna be first time landlords and we're gonna have first time renters or for us anyways, first time renters, they may not be first time renters, but um, yeah, lots of work, very busy. Plus I'm working on a photo booth uh, project. Um, so with actually, uh, with Lee from Home-Based Event Business, link in the description. So tons of things going on and that's why I haven't been making a ton of videos, but I thought I would give you guys an update, show you the new place and uh, show you, I guess, you know, what a little bit of hard work can do. Now, interestingly enough in this house, I do have a little bit of a mystery, uh, a bad mystery. I ripped out the carpets, and there's, uh, maybe from a distance, you can see that there is some water damage. Right here, as you can see, that's an outside wall, and it's also in the other rooms as well, all over here. These are all outside walls, as you can see, you know, that's the outside there. And there's a little bit of water damage, but this is very old. There's definitely no moisture here. It hasn't happened recently. It leaked a couple times. You can see there's different sort of edges to this. So it happened at least like four, four or five times, maybe during like big winter storms or big winter melts. And th therefore, I don't know, like, um, bit of a mystery. No one really knows anything about it. I, we contacted the, the homeowners, said, hey, you know, do you know anything about this? No, apparently they don't. Yes, a little bit of a mystery. We'll see what happens. They did replace the roof a couple of years ago, at least the, so the shingles on the roof. And so hopefully that would have solved any problem. This is the second floor and the problem is only on the second floor. And the ceiling butts up to the house just below these windows. So it kind of makes sense that whatever the problem was, it was probably a, a, where the ceiling butts up. There might've been some kind of gap there, maybe a lack of silicone. Uh, it wasn't uh, um, uh, sheathed correctly. Sheathing is not the right word. I'm not a roofer, it can cut me a break, but Clearly something was amiss, but it doesn't seem, there's no moisture. I remember the guy using his like moisture gun or whatever, or um, uh, what did he use? That heat thing as well. So uh, th there, di there didn't seem to be any real moisture around. Uh, there was not a moisture gun and moisture sensor of some sort, but anyway. Um, and yeah, it's completely dry to the touch. So this must've happened quite some time ago. Uh, but yeah, that would have been terrible, you know, if, if it starts leaking through the drywall or something like that. 
Anyways, guys, <laughs> that's an update. I'm gonna start talking, now we're talking construction here, right? We're talking shop. But a uh, little update on what's going on, and I'm excited to say, yeah, we're first time landlords, get a little bit of hard work, and suddenly you, have, you can own a couple properties, and that's where we're at, and it's super exciting. And uh, let's get some business done. Work hard, make some money, and uh, you know, maybe one day uh, this place will be a bit, bit bigger. That'd be awesome. So take it easy. We'll see you later. Let's get some business done.